Uh, we made GAC the other day, really interesting. We're gonna do a whole video about it, we're gonna do a live video about it. Um, by the time you see this, we'll, we'll have done it. Yeah, that video's already up. So we, we made GAC um, for the live stream. Uh, it was really neat, really interesting. I thought it was super cool. It's a non-Newtonian fluid. Um, I didn't want to make this the night before. I really wanted it to be fresh. So we're gonna go ahead and make a GAC again. And we're gonna put it in a balloon. And then we're gonna put a charge inside of that balloon. Um, so I need to go ahead and make some more GAC. All right, so it's just, all, all it is is it's Elmer's glue, water, and then borax. But the thing that I remember last time is you really wanna mix up the water and the, the Elmer's glue. Like, that's, yeah, good, keep, slower, 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 yeah, slower, slower, slower. Yep. GAC is a non-Newtonian fluid. Super cool, very interesting stuff. GAC was originally made in 1992, which stemmed from the popular show on Nickelodeon, Double Dare. GAC has its roots as a term, meaning heroin as a street term. It's kind of weird that it ended up on Nickelodeon, but which is even more ironic is that the creators of Nickelodeon's Double Dare knew that GAC was also a street term for heroin, and they still went with it. Uh, so, you know, that kind of, kind of shed some light on your childhood. It's like, you know, you're watching everybody get slimed and here we find out, it actually means heroin. It's not white. It's like, yeah, it's like my thumb squeezing it in there. Like I can tell, like, it, yeah, it, it's not very liquidy. I think it'll blow up the balloon. I don't think it'll, I don't think the gig's gonna do anything. In 1996, Nickelodeon came out with scented GAC, which had weird flavors such as vanilla, hot dog, sunscreen, and pepperoni pizza. <laughs> that was so hot. Oh, oh my god, it went straight <laughs> in. Around it. And duct tape. Oh, it's a duct tape. Oh, duct tape. Let's get the duct tape. Duct taped over there. I can't believe that worked. <laughs> Alright, so we successfully made GAC and put it in a balloon and put the charge inside of the balloon. I am extremely curious about this. I don't actually have any good prediction because I don't know how this is gonna react. Um, if I had a gun to my head and I had to, to say what was gonna happen, I, I think I'm a little more hopeful actually, but I would say that it's gonna explode and there's gonna go gack everywhere. But I think that's really more like weighted about what I want to happen. Um, I'm gonna say 70% this thing is going to explode and GAC is gonna go everywhere. Fingers crossed. But the question always is, will it GAC? I mean, will it blow? All right, we're gonna go GAC on three. All right, I am ready to launch. All right, and three, two, one, GAC attack. I have no clue what happened. I wonder, let, let's go take a look. Well, it looks like it, it definitely exploded. I mean, there's there's little bits and pieces of GAC all over the place. Most part, it looks like, I mean, it, you know, kind of stayed intact for the most part. I mean, we're st we still have a lot of GAC down here. Um, I can't fully say that it, I mean. We might have to check the replay. I, I, yeah, I, I think we're gonna have to check the replay, people. Here's the 
here's here's what I think. All right. It's a non-Newtonian fluid, so it's both solid and a liquid at the same time. I would say the liquid portion of it definitely blew up 100%. The solid portion of it pretty much did what a solid would do with that type of charge. It really didn't blow up. I mean, the structural integrity stayed intact. So, if we split the difference, I would say that it 50% blew up because it's both a solid and a liquid at the same time. And if you guys haven't seen the video on how to make GAC, um, click right here. We show you exactly how to make GAC. It's super cool, it's super fun. It's like a really easy experiment. You can do it anytime. It's cool for Halloween. It's cool for like any time period. It's really interesting, it's super fun. So you don't need to go like online and buy it. You can just make it yourself and you can make as much as you want. So 50%, it blew up. The water side blew up, the solid side did not. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up and let us know in the comment section below what you want to see blow up in our next episodes. And subscribe! We have new videos every week and we want to make sure you never miss a single Will It Blow video. Also, we couldn't have made this possible without the help from our professional stuntmen, James and Matt. Their information is in the description below and we'll see you really soon.